Welcome to Drawfee, where we take dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Nathan. I'm Julia. I'm Jacob. And I'm Karina. Nathan. Yeah? Today, mm-hmm. we're getting into the heart of the cards. <gasps> oh, is it a Yu-Gi-Oh episode we're doing? Is it a Yu-Gi-Oh episode we're doing? Is it a Yu-Gi-Oh episode we're doing? No, it's not. You all know it's not a Yu-Gi-Oh episode we're doing. We know what we're doing. It's the heart of the cards. It's the heart what? of the cards, Yu-Gi-Oh. It's a tarot episode. Uh... It's not... <laughs> I'm sorry, Karina. You knew going in. Am I, I going to get the queen of hearts so I can get the heart of the cards? I got a pair of twos. <laughs> You're all disasters. We've all been banned to the Shadow Realm for these two. This is not a Yu-Gi-Oh episode. It is now. This is from the uh, the Drawfy Patreon Discord from AJ. They said, could we see some Drawfy tarot cards? Yeah. Maybe randomly deal a tarot card, draw our versions of it. I love that. That's the suggestion. That's what we're doing. We're not doing Yu-Gi-Oh. We're what? doing tarot. There's tarot cards in Yu-Gi-Oh. But is there Yu-Gi-Oh in tarot cards? You Ooh. don't know. I mean, there might be after Proof this episode. there isn't. <laughs> I, th- I think I know where this is going. No, yeah. we're not doing it. No Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> Draw a card, any okay. card. Nathan, your card is the sun. <laughs> okay. Whoa. I'm gonna tell you. I'm going to tell you the description of the sun. I'm on randomtarotcard.com. Okay. And the description says, the sun suggests that the answer to your questions is plainly before you like a shining light, but it is best to approach it coolly and at a certain distance as the truth could burn you. Wow. Incredible. Dang. A zinger. That's a, that's a deep thoughts right yeah, there. Yeah, that's some deep stuff. Nathan, are you ready for the truth, dude? I mean, I'm going to approach it coolly. You better approach it so coolly <laughs> because it might, it might burn me. Nathan, is this you? It might be me. <laughs> it might just be me. Is it? Was it supposed to be, or it, it just is it? Uh, I think it might be me. It might be you. I think if we're doing Drawfy <laughs> themed tarot cards, Nathan I feel is like, the sun. I feel like I would be the sun. I don't know. Wait, are we doing Drawfy themed tarot cards? There's really no rules, to be honest with you. I mean, that's what the suggestion said. But anything we draw will technically be drawfy themed. Are we doing drawfy themed tarot cards? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what is happening right now? <laughs> Am I going crazy? <laughs> are, wait. Wait, 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 wait. But wait, are wait. we doing drawfy themed tarot cards? <laughs> Are we doing okay? So, are we doing tarot cards that are based off of Drawfy? Or I, I just or told you there's no rules. Tarot cards. I literally just told you there's no rules. Anything we do is Drawfy themed because we did it, <laughs> and it's on Drawfy. Imagine like doing a reading and you draw your first card, and you're like, "Ah, oh, I hope I don't get death or something." And then it's like this feel. The fun thing about our recording setup is the screen is exactly the wrong dimension <laughs> yeah. for a card. Yeah. Exactly bad. That's what makes it such a unique tarot deck. You have to do it sideways. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't your mama's tarot deck. <laughs> this is Drawfee's tarot deck. I mean, when you do the Celtic cross, you kind of you put cards in all different directions anyway, so they should be readable from from all different sides. Celtic Cross, that's a Yu-Gi-Oh monster, right? Yeah. The Celtic Guardian. And the obnoxious Celtic Cross. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that one from Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> See, it is a Yu-Gi-Oh episode. If you try hard enough. I don't have to try at all. Tarot cards is the easiest thing to make Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> I, I just, I know they're all like super designed and there's like a full scene on all of them, but like this is just, it's just the sun. Like, I don't know. Because they're so symbolic. Tarot can be whatever you want it to be, Nathan. <laughs> the Drawfee Tarot especially. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you think that the cards we draw in this, like if you read those cards, you would find out Drawfee's future? <laughs> Whoa, maybe. So we're starting with the sun. We're starting with the sun. I want like a tarot expert. Um, oh no, are we doing know? a reading live as we draw? Yeah, well, we're not. That's scary. 
but somebody who's watching this is going to do it and they're going to go down in the comments and tell us what it means. You're reading what the cards mean as we get them. <laughs> yeah, but all together they mean But all together it's di it means it's different. different stuff depending on what mm -hmm. order you draw them in, right? Yeah. Is that right? That's right. <laughs> Have you done a tarot reading, Karina? Yeah. I tried getting into tarot when I was in the seventh grade, I think. I thought but you were going to say the 70s. You, the cards told you not to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the card said, don't you think this is kind of difficult? And I was like, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back to Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> These cards are smart, man. They know. <laughs> I've done it a, a few times. I've never like done, given a reading, but I've gotten a reading a few times. Did it did it come true? Probably. I don't remember what they said, but it's likely <laughs> that I could. <laughs> what a good <laughs> That's what great, a memorable, Jacob. Yeah, that's awesome, dude. Happy for you. <laughs> Maybe they said that I that I wouldn't remember and it wouldn't affect me. <laughs> and you never did. Yeah. Wow. I don't know, is that like this isn't a particularly funny drawing. It's just like it's a nice drawing. It's, it's just yeah, me it's just very pleasant. Raining my my rays, it's my you. sunny rays. This is actually just a self portrait. Yeah, this is just I just just gonna draw me as whatever I got. I'm glad I got the sun <laughs> and not like the asshole. The asshole. <laughs> yeah, the famous tarot. <laughs> <laughs> that smelly that smelly butt man that everyone hates. I didn't get that one, so I'm pretty happy about my <laughs> drawn the asshole guy who shows up to the party and everyone goes, oh, no. Oh, dang, that guy? <laughs> it symbolizes you showing up to the party and everyone going, oh, no. <laughs> the description just says, stop. Stop. <laughs> uh, this is my drawing for this episode. It's a good drawing. This, this is, is nice. Pick. Put this on your your Tinder. I'm a <laughs> <laughs> new Tinder pick. <laughs> um. All right, I'm done. Someone else. Is it me? Yeah, it's Karina. It's, Karina. Time. it's me. I will draw a card. Draw a card, then draw a card. The Empress. Oh, nice. The Empress calls on you to confront a challenge through kindness, openness, and generosity. But you must be careful not to let others use your goodwill for selfish purposes. Damn. Hmm. Kill them with kindness is that card. But don't let them kill you with kindness. Oh my God. It's like two is dueling assassins. Yeah, they both have dueling. kindness knives. Dueling? No, don't say it. You said the secret <laughs> word. Oh, no. Should I also just make this be? I can be an empress. I don't see why not. Do it. I mean, if you set the trend, then I feel like we're all going to have to follow it. If two people do it, then the rest of us must also do it. I don't know who else is the empress. Yeah, it's, it's you. I'm saying go for it. <laughs> I'm just going to pigeonhole you two into <laughs> having to draw yourselves. I can't be contained. We all know this. <laughs> yeah, Julia's going to draw a room. I'm going to draw whatever the hell I want, as per usual. That would just be a self-portrait in yeah. a less literal sense. <laughs> okay, so me. Everything we draw is a reflection of our inner self. Wow, man. If you think about it. Are you the son? Whoa. No, Nathan's the son. I'm probably oh, going to get oh. the asshole guy. No yeah. My luck. That's Jacob. <laughs> if I get the fool, I'm canceling this episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please. I hope you get the fool. I will shut it down so fast. Here's me, the empress. You're like a benevolent empress. Aren't I, though? I would say so, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I would say so. <laughs> don't you think so, Jacob? I have been nothing but nice to you. <laughs> I don't know if uh, approaching with openness and kindness is your general MO. I like to think I'm a nice person in in some ways. <laughs> you're, you're definitely a nice person. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, just, just don't cross me. Yeah, but that's kind of like what it says. Yeah. Card like that's yeah, me, the baby. Is nice, but don't don't mess around. That is what it said, right? I already forgot. <laughs>
or else you're going to get the scepter. <laughs> it's like don't get taken advantage of. You know, you got to be kind but strong. Karina's got the, the tough outer shell baby inside. Oh, look at these. Yeah, yeah, big, that's big me. Big eyes. <laughs> the empress eyes. The empress eyes. She possesses the royal eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine like a royal bloodline where all of the <laughs> <laughs> members of the family have big old googly eyes? <laughs> <laughs> a peasant was born with the royal eyes. <laughs> How could <laughs> this be? <laughs> and finally Why? found the heir. Why? <laughs> <laughs> What's up, everybody? <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Doing a little jig. I wonder how that starts off. Someone's born with big googly eyes, and someone's like, I've never seen eyes like this. Clearly, they must be gifts from God. And someone else is like, I don't think so. Are they Heresy. <laughs> <laughs> off with their head. <laughs> I like this pose. Oh, yeah. I'm sitting in my throne because I'm an empress. This is a comfy looking throne. Yeah. I mean, I, you haven't even drawn the throne, but just based on the way you're sitting in it. Yeah. It looks pretty comfy. Maybe it's one of those really comfy, like, I'm going to say chairs because I forget exactly what they're called. Like, no shit, Karina. It's a chair. <laughs> I My a aunt boy? has one. Maybe. It's just a really big chair it's a practically recliner? a couch but it's a chair an easy uh, 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 an easy, easy chair. boy <laughs> an easy boy is it not called easy boy why does that sound familiar is it lazy. a lazy boy or an easy boy <laughs> an easy boy <laughs> which one is it <laughs> i was so ready to accept easy boy <laughs> i was like yeah that sounds right <laughs> I mean, it could exist, but if so, it's very funny. If we start our own rival chair line and call it Easy Boy. Droffy presents Easy Boy. We'll contact DFTBA, see if they're down to make Can you manufacture chairs? Rest your tush on an Easy Boy. The first chair 100% made of enamel pins. It's not comfortable to sit in. <laughs> the name is ironic. <laughs> it's not easy or it's comfortable. <laughs> it's it's what you say to someone when they go to sit and you go, easy boy. Easy boy. I wouldn't sit there if I were you. Look closer. It's all pins. <laughs> it's all pins. Karina, you look like you're shell-shocked. You got the wide, tired eyes. <laughs> That's just my face. <laughs> Ooh, I want to wear a cape. <laughs> nice. Yeah, you're the empress. My go-to formal wear for my easy boy. <laughs> Are you holding a mug in your right hand, or is that your fist? That's my fist. I'm holding something, <laughs> but I haven't decided yet. <laughs> Maybe I'm just sitting there with clenched fists. <laughs> <laughs> just <laughs> clenched, trembling fists. <laughs> Yeah. With that look on your face. Waiting for someone to cross me. <laughs> Get on my bad side. <laughs> you know it's coming. It happens every day. I have levied my judgment. Any questions? Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just wearing my pajamas under this cape because oh, I nice. can do whatever I want. I'm the empress. What are you going to do? Tell me no? Yeah, that don't work. <laughs> That's not how it goes, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> a little short sleeve pajamas. I love that. In case it gets hot. It's almost August. I can't think of anything else right now. <laughs> <laughs> Summer PJs. Yeah. It makes it look like your legs are also like clenched like your fists. Because <laughs> they're not Straight resting out. on anything. They're just kicked out and like flexing. They can rest on something. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, you know what it's got to be. Hmm. A subject? Why did I draw my head so big? Why did I draw everything so wrong? Because <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah, not wrong. You're the empress. Yeah, no one's going right. to tell you. Oh, it's, oh. Okay. it's time to figure out what a pose is on the spot. Oh, I see what's, I what see what's happening here. Wrong. <laughs> I've drawn this to empress standards. This is like a person who crossed you. And now they have to do this until your anger subsides. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not yet. You're still clenching. Yeah. <laughs> it's like not the worst punishment. Yeah, you just no. you just gotta sit there. Yeah, you're 
your 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 legs aren't too heavy. Yeah. Just do a, rest in your little feet up there. <laughs> but they might have like other stuff to do. Oh, it's Kaiba. <laughs> Is this Kaiba? <laughs> oh, it's Kaiba. I said. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm Just sorry. Are you speaking to me? <laughs> Empress, is this the heart of the cards? I feel like I can't talk the rest of the episode. <laughs> You're allowed. Okay, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> If I get the emperor, though, I'm changing some things around. <laughs> I hope you get the fool. <laughs> I'm not going to get the fool. There's no way. There's The fool's not a bad card. I don't know how his, his thing goes. I'm just not going to. No, I have to draw him in his coat. Uh. <laughs> just remember, you can fix all this later. Yeah. yeah. What if I just completely change this and post like I tend to do nowadays? <laughs> You can do that too, dude. Nobody cares. You're the empress. Yeah. Yeah. If anyone complains, I will. This could be you. <laughs> you will mete out punishment. <laughs> Kaiba will come in the dead of the night <laughs> and take you. <laughs> He'll take your blue it's eyes. It's just the difference between <laughs> a fast fade in of the render and a slow fade in of the render, how yeah. close it is. If it matches up, you get a nice slow fade in. If it's very different, oop. <laughs> yeah, make it fast as hell. Get it in quick. Get it in quick so people Can't. don't notice. I mean, you're the best person I know at drawing Kaiba's coat. Thank yeah. you. I know what it looks like. It's just a weird shape, and this is a really specific pose. Kaiba's not usually in this in this pose. Nah. Maybe Jack Deviantart it is. <laughs> 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 I want a fur collar. I like it because you look so baby. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you look so angry baby. The sequel to Boss Baby, Empress Baby. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> um, I feel like I need more nice things. Let's have some shrubbery. Oh, <laughs> are you outside? <laughs> no, I just like, I, I like to imagine that I could have a lot of plants I don't, but I feel like in a different <laughs> life I could. <laughs> well, yeah, if you've got that. subjects who can take care of the plants for you. Yeah, and maybe there's like I have a few more threatening objects. I guess if it's drawfy themed, I should hide. I should hide this some drawfy nice. <laughs> references in here. What are my most threatening drawfy things? I guess pudding tin. <laughs> <laughs> don't put Puddington, no. He's Puddington. I don't want to think about Puddington. We have to remember that the summary for the Empress card was kill him with kindness, and we've we've hidden several knives. Yeah. Yeah, I'm now like Puddington. For when with... you just got to kill them. You just sometimes you just got to kill them. <laughs> sometimes kindness doesn't work. Sometimes people will take advantage of my kindness, and I say... Have you met Puddington? <laughs> He's baby. <laughs> what did he have? He had a big old tooth. You got that? <laughs> yeah. Is that a broken bottle? <laughs> did he smash a bottle? It was supposed to be a fork. I'm in a hurry. <laughs> Puddington's drunk. Puddington's in a hurry, too. He couldn't find a fork, so he just smashed a bottle. What other bad things have I drawn? Let's see, you can have the demon train in there. <laughs> I'm bringing back all my greatest hits for my my rain. <laughs> this is such a fun draw. <laughs> yeah. I forgot what it looks like. I think it's I remember. Basically like that. Yeah. <laughs> and for and for you stream watchers, here's a Donald Duck cat really quick. Oh. Oh god. <laughs> He's there. Your foulest drawing of all. Now it looks like you don't want to turn around and see these creatures behind you. Here, maybe Oh, there. she lost the royal eyes. <laughs> Where did they go? The false empress. Now I'm looking directly at you. Oh, no. <laughs> so please don't take advantage of my kindness. You wouldn't <laughs> want to do that. 
Amazing. I don't know why everything is so oriented to the right, but (laughs) maybe I'll fix that in post too. (laughs) No, I like this sort of ominous negative space off to the left. Yeah, maybe I'll add a a background and we'll leave it a mystery for the future. (laughs) (laughs) Tune in to right now in the episode to see what Karina put there. (laughs) All right, here's here's the Empress. (laughs) So good. Thank you. I am impressed. Oh, thank you. Oh. Oh. I'm going to go now. It's Jacob Toyn. Okay, let's flip the card. If this is the fool... I'm going to be furious. Come on, come oh. on. No, are you kidding me? <laughs> Is it? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually unbelievable. Can you slide that onto the screen? Just to what are the everyone? odds? Tarot is real. The flippin' fool. The spirits The cards, no. The heart of the cards. <laughs> wow. This is- Unbelievable. <laughs> My God, you actually got the fool. You manifested it. <laughs> Incredible. God, Jacob. I'm so mad. Really good. Oh my really God. Really good. I, you know, tarot cards, they know about content. They understand. <laughs> the tarot cards know all. I really wish that that was a bit. They understand <laughs> setup payoff. I can't Incredible. like explain to the audience enough just how that it like just happened. It was so unlikely. <laughs> There's so many cards. It's the heart of the cards, Jacob. That's you. Look in the mirror. I wish we had face cams or just like a camera <laughs> set up just to just to cut to Jacob's face when that happened. <laughs> I was I'm I'm upset. <laughs> Jacob, the fool isn't a bad thing. Read yeah. the description. I'm gonna read the fool. The Fool, card zero of the tarot, encourages you to try something adventurous and new. Unfamiliarity can be invigorating, but take care not to put yourself in needless danger. It's literally the premise of like our speed draw episodes. (laughs) I can't believe you got the Fool. It's actually amazing. We make ourselves into fools to try stuff. It's beautiful. I really didn't think it was going to come up. Like I wasn't, the only thing I wasn't thinking about was what I would draw for the fool. <laughs> Incredible. Oh the fool God. is okay. um, Iggy's stand in JoJo. That's the dog. That's the dog. Oh, right? the dog has a stand? Yeah, I'd be remiss if I didn't talk a little bit about JoJo. While we're talking about tarot cards. I mean, eventually they run out of tarot cards and just have to start naming stands after bands. Well, first they do Egyptian gods, then bands. But Egyptian uh, god cards. The Egyptian god cards. Everything's connected. You want to know yeah. something fun? So in Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, one of the villains uses a tarot-based deck, and his like trump card is the world. So he's always going, the world Who's the guy? Who's that guy? Dio. Same voice actor. Whoa. <laughs> That's typecasting. Everything's connected. I love that. <laughs> to Yu-Gi-Oh. Aw. <laughs> Is that you drawing the fool? <laughs> <laughs> this is a really good drawing already. I mean, I'm assuming that I'm going to be like trying something new here, <laughs> and it's going to be dangerous. Ooh. I'm going to be doing a dangerous maneuver of some kind. It's Newsday. <laughs> Live every day like it's Newsday. Oh God, I guess yeah. it does make sense, huh? Like, yeah. it it works. The Fool works for Trophy in total. We are all the Fool. But it's very funny that you drew it. <laughs> yeah. It's not funny. <laughs> No, it's super funny. It's probably the funniest thing that could have happened. <laughs> I it's I don't see an even single humor in it. <laughs> Not one. Not one. Like I was gonna I was gonna maybe suggest that if you didn't get the fool, you pretend like you did anyway. <laughs> but we didn't we didn't have to do that because yeah. fate was on our side. One. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so excited to see what's happening here. I feel like I'm going to be doing like a like a tightrope walk. Oh, oh, that is scary. So it's like new and invigorating. 
but it's dangerous. I'm wearing a tank top right now, so I'll be wearing a tank top <laughs> in this too. Because like Karina said, it's August almost. Yeah. By the time you watch this, it's definitely August or maybe even later. Or after <laughs> August even. Guess we'll never know. I mean, we will know. No. <laughs> <laughs> definitely no. The Empress says we won't know. <laughs> Sorry, I guess, I guess you're right. We won't know. Oh, this is fun. I like this. This is great. Sweat. <laughs> more sweat on here. My tank top has a rectangle on it Ooh. with the design. It looks like a little marshmallow. Uh, I don't know how you're supposed to tightrope walk, but presumably I'm not like doing it right. <laughs> yeah, you're I mean, just trying it out. If you don't fall, you, you've done something right, I guess. <laughs> That's a good point. You all ever go to the park... And I mean, not now, but did y'all, <laughs> did y'all ever go to the park and see those guys with like the tightrope, like the real low tightrope set up between two trees, just like oh, doing, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I've seen doing those little balances? There was one time in middle school, we had to go to a ropes course for student council and it was like that, but a lot. <laughs> Were you on student council? In middle school. What was your position on the council? I don't, even, I, don't I didn't have a position. I just helped. <laughs> General volunteer. Wow, that rope should be tighter than that. <laughs> yeah, this just seems irresponsible. It was, not, it was not weighted properly. The last person who was on it was much lighter. <laughs> Maybe it's not like the tightest tight rope. Yeah, this is a loose rope. <laughs> I mean, Jacob's making it tight. I always make it tight. <laughs> <laughs> attached to like a building oh wow a building yeah this is a very bold thing for you to do it's like no safety harness <laughs> <laughs> i don't know why i'm doing it it's because i didn't i didn't understand i'm a cautionary tale i didn't understand the line between adventurous and dangerous mm. and so it's like you know you you learn from my mistakes I'm dead. You should have started <laughs> with a dead. ropes course. <laughs> I'm Middle dead schoolers do that. <laughs> <laughs> it's too late. I'm dead now. <laughs> Rip cheek. I can't do it. I can't do it now. I wish you would have told me sooner. You didn't ask. <laughs> <laughs> there's like the door that leads out to the roof. Mm -hmm. And maybe there's like some people cheering. Oh, damn. You made it really far, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm still, you know, I'm still going. Fake it till you make it or until you die. <laughs> Fake it till you make it. I whisper as I walk out onto the tightrope. <laughs> <laughs> I think this, this one person's not impressed, though. <laughs> that person's concerned for you. They They're know what's up. Watching. They're just like, guys, I don't think we made the tightrope tight enough. <laughs> He was like, oh, crap, that was my one job. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I swore up and down it was tight enough, and now I really don't think it was. <laughs> Is it the four of us, like, in the background? It's me, Karina, it and Naven. <laughs> <laughs> Whose job was it amongst you to make the tightrope tight enough? Oh, it was definitely me. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I missed... I, I just missed that Discord message. <laughs> Didn't get the notification. Like, oh, sorry. Just I get I get the notification right now on my phone. You saying just saw this? Yeah, just saw this. Um, <laughs> sorry, is guys. It, is it too late now? Yeah. To... <laughs> <laughs> just seeing this now. Just getting caught up. Yeah, uh, Jacob, can you step off the rope for a second so I can tighten it real quick? Yeah, real quick. Um, hey, before you. Sorry, just seeing this. Um, Give me give me a few minutes to make sure the, the ropes tighten up. You've already started. You've already started? Okay. What's that? Is that your beeper? Oh, that's, that's my, my that's, that's my me phone. messaging. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> beeper. And the the message Nathan's message is coming through right now. Jacob's trying two new things, tightrope walking and learning how to use a beeper. <laughs> And it's like buzzing out of control. Sorry, I was busy being the sun. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have time to check on the, the tightness of the rope. <laughs> no. Um, I forgot there needs to be like another part of this drawing. 
to eh? fill all the rest of this space. Oh, like it I did. To me. Yeah, we can all just leave big pieces of our canvas. <laughs> the big emptiness around you is very Yeah, I feel like it works. I, think. I feel like you didn't need to point that out. Yeah, it's very ominous. We don't know. We can't see the other end of the tightrope. Here we go. We're going to do some like- Is know, that the sun? Is- this is metaphorical. <laughs> yeah, it's just me. <laughs> it's me oh, coming in. No. He's trying to get a closer look. <laughs> it's here. I'm like, hey, did you get my message? <laughs> hey, hey sorry, I just saw this. This is a metaphor oh. for the unknown. Oh, See? the part oh, you've scary. done is the known. Yeah, it's it's really scary. But maybe what lies at the other side is a great reward. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it'll all be worth it in the uh-huh. end if I can hit the right keyboard shortcuts. <laughs> I like when you do these big old compositional shapes. Thank you. They always look so nice. It makes me not have to draw more things. We have that option? <laughs> <laughs> we have that option. You, whatever dark pact you made. Oh. Yeah, you clearly. You, Julia. I don't. It doesn't let you. I, I, I hope you do. <laughs> I no, I can't. Aww. I can't help it. It's what I do. It's the same thing that makes her draw every floorboard. Yep, <laughs> the drawing enters your body. <laughs> Very good, Jacob. I'm so happy. I'm so happy you got the fool. <laughs> Me too. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> oh, Just some, clouds. Add some clouds. Yeah, happy little clouds. That's how you know I'm up really high. Yeah, even yeah. Taro is ragging on you. <laughs> yeah, even Taro. <laughs> Can't catch a break. break. (laughs) Well, this is my drawing of me as the fool. (laughs) But at least I'm trying something, you know? At least I'm putting myself out there. Yeah. It's inspiring. Julia, are you ready? Yeah. All right, Julia, let's see what you get. The tower. The tower. tower. Ominous. That's that's a place. It's a setting. Yeah. (laughs) We did it. (laughs) Julia gets to draw a building. Hooray. (laughs) I had so many ideas in mind, and none of them, for once, involved buildings. All right. A building can be a character. You can be a tower. The description for the tower is... The tower warns you that part of your life is in dire need of restructuring <laughs> may soon crumble. Oh, no. Oh. But with some planning, you can build something much stronger in its place. Oh. Why is it that every single <laughs> flipping time I do tarot, it's always like your life's shit and you're the cause of it? It's either your life's <laughs> shit or it's about to be shit yeah. any second now. So get ready. Yeah, it's not it's not shit yet. It's just yeah. crumbling. Yeah. Gotta do a little remodel. Yeah. Gotta get some contractors in there. Sometimes you're a tower. Yug. <laughs> you. Sometimes you're a tower, Yug. I'm a tower now, Yug. <laughs> Come inside, you climb to the top. The view's amazing up here. So you're the tower. Mm-hmm. You're the tower. I want to say that the picture of the tower on this website is a tower getting struck by lightning and bursting into flames while people fall screaming out of the windows. I would get that. Sometimes sometimes it's just be like that. (laughs) In in JoJo, the tower is a a beetle that murders a bunch of people on a plane. A tower can be anything. A tower can be anything. (laughs) One thing we learn on Droppy is that we have to stop prejudging what things can and can't be. Yeah. Towers, much like gamers, can be anything. Can be anything. Mm -hmm. I think we could all learn a lesson from gamers. (laughs) You couldn't even get through that sentence. I like what's happening here, though. Ooh. Yeah, you're already off to some stuff. Already doing some Julia stuff. Is this a design or is this a grid? It's a design. Okay, cool. It's like if you bust out some grid work. <laughs> How many hours do I have? Ten. Yeah, live on live on air. <laughs> Welcome to Julia's Tower Hour. <laughs> oh, I should have done that before. It- oh no. <laughs> okay. Well. <laughs> oh, I was buddy. going to do like a cool design, but I'll do it in post. How about That's- that? Yeah, everything's going to be great in post. Are these arrows? I wanted them to start like you're in a wheat field 
So you have like the little wheat Ooh. pops. Yeah. And then they go down to be like these crumbling downward Damn, sort dude. of arrows. Why do you always, I, I said this in just a recent episode that went up, but why do you have so many art thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to do tarot like 10-ish years ago. <laughs> I I looked into it because a lot of people had suggested that I do tarot. Like make a deck or do make a deck. I still think you should do that. And then I just never did it. Or you you always did the like um horoscope drawings for Dorkly, yes. which feel very similar in style to like how tarot cards look typically. Yeah. Dude, you would make a dope tarot deck. Yeah. I was thinking about it. I'm still thinking about it. It's never too late. Maybe I'll do it. Take some inspiration from the fool. Go out on that tightrope. <laughs> yeah. You make your tarot deck, and I'll make Nathan's big book of dinosaur lies. Okay. I like this. And I'll make dinner. <laughs> 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 Just imagining you shouting that from the middle of the tightrope. <laughs> Jacob, no. <laughs> and I'll make dinner. <laughs> no goofing on the tightrope. <laughs> Nathan's loose rope. Nathan's loose rope. <laughs> oh dang! Is he? He already started. <laughs> Nathan will make a loose rope. I'll make yeah. a loose rope. Yeah, I was gonna make my big book of dinosaur lies, but it turned out I missed the memo. I just tied this rope loosely instead. Sorry, yeah. guys. Oh, it was a tight rope. I just read rope. I skimmed. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have time to read the whole thing. I had time to read 50% of the words, <laughs> and I picked rope. <laughs> there were two words, and the one I chose was rope. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have just gotten tight, and that's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> tight. tight. Oh, tight, a rope. That's sort of how I read it. <laughs> I just got like a really cool looking rope. <laughs> that's what you wanted, right? Yeah. <laughs> Now I have to, oh. in the render, make the rope look really cool. <laughs> <laughs> that can't be hard. Oh, it's crumbling the higher up it gets, huh? Yeah, I had remembered that little bit in my blind panic to, to figure out how to make a tower look interesting. <laughs> to draw a tower. I see you're also leaning to the right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I am going to put, because everyone inserted themselves a little bit, I have to put myself in here. Ooh. But you have to be very small and you have to draw you in the last 30 seconds of the drawing. Yeah, I'm surprised. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Julia, you're floating. <laughs> you're an airplane. In the night Come and sky. Rescue me. Rescue me from the like a shooting star. <laughs> 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 Sick reference, Karina. <laughs> wow, incredible. Thank you. <laughs> um, all right. I'm going to... Who's listening to B.O.B. in 2020? <laughs> I'm, wearing, I'm wearing a little hood. You're probably thinking about how you could have built this tower better. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> so you got to get a foundation guy. Maybe yeah. that's where Jacob's tight rope is. <laughs> I'm up at the top. Oh, man. <laughs> tight rope <laughs> Oh That's yeah, it's good. <laughs> oh, you got so far. Oh, you like actually, you know, from this angle, the rope doesn't look too. Given how long of a distance it had to go, it's not that loose. You like walked an entire mile on that tightrope. <laughs> um, obviously, doesn't need to be drawn, but <laughs> can we just say that tower is uh is full of vampires? A tower of vampires, yeah. It's yeah. implied. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I feel like that was everyone knows. <laughs> On the that. final render, if you zoom in, you'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Julia's gigantic render. <laughs> zoom in. So the second I heard the tower, I thought of Annihilation, which I realized they refer to it as like a lighthouse, I think. It is a, a lighthouse. lighthouse or... Okay. It's a well, lighthouse. The, the character in Annihilation refers to it as the tower. Oh, right. Okay. If you read the book. If you read the book, which I have not. Everyone's like, what's this weird staircase going down? And the main character's like, for some reason, I know this is a tower. And I'm going <laughs> to keep calling it a tower, even though it goes down. That's cool. Yeah, I am getting some Annihilation vibes 
Yeah, so that's that's a little bit of the vibe I was going for. It's very cool. I think, I guess. It was the only thing that my brain could grasp on to. <laughs> I was like prepared to get something very apt for me, like a bunch of swords or death or something. And then I got the tower, which it is in its own way. You know. I feel like this suits you. Yeah, yeah, I think so too. You get to do a full ass composition. Yeah, I yeah. feel like we're when we see the full render of this, this is like the sketch of a really good composition <laughs> that will require a lot of work. So yeah. sorry. Oh, uh, that's my mistake. I'm gonna do <laughs> Nathan's uh, little Boyd's. Maybe yeah. Nathan's like up there. I'm up there. Yeah, those are my rays. Yeah. <laughs> Karina's in the tower. Yeah, I'm chilling at the top. At, at the, the top. top, and I'm tight roving over. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. We're all coming together to yeah. hang out. I think this is a good solid start for a tarot deck. Yeah, yeah I agree. Absolutely. God, it would be such a mismatched tarot deck. Yeah, it really. Yeah, we we split it up four ways, <laughs> and it's just <laughs> at random. Yeah, that works. There's there's it's. Are there four suits? Four. I think there's four suits, right? It's cups, yeah, heart, sword. diamond. Oh, damn it, Julia! <laughs> Horseshoes <laughs> and hand grenades. <laughs> 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 yeah. Um I don't know. I don't I don't know. Is this is this good? Yes. This is great. Yeah, okay. it rules. It's really I'm good. I'm so excited, excited to, to see, see yeah. Version, yeah. The tower. The tower. Yeah, it's it's fun because Ooh. whenever we do a Drawfee episode, we are kind of telling ourselves our future in that this is something we'll <laughs> have to color in at some point. <laughs> That's true. So we're just leaning into that. That's a future we can all believe in. Wow. 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 Beautiful. Beautiful. Well, you don't need a fortune teller to tell you what I'm about to say. S uh, subscribe to our channel. <laughs> Hit the bell. Uh, Nathan, support us on Patreon. That was good. I had one, too. Do you want to know what mine was going to be? Oh, yeah, yeah. Do it. I was going to say, uh, I just read the cards, and the only future I see is one where you subscribe. That's also Drawfee. really good. That's the one I was thinking. Two of. really good ones. Take your pick. Either one is a great reason to yeah. subscribe <laughs> to this channel. <laughs> Hit the bell. Uh, like. Let comment. us know which of those two was your favorite. <laughs> yeah, let us know which one. Uh, and uh, if you really like what we do, you can support us directly on Patreon. We've got some links in the description as well as probably on screen if those work. And uh, <laughs> we're sorry. 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 Sorry.